So you might be trying to figure out how you can increase the speed of your Wi-Fi connection on your iPhone. Now, this is a double-edged sword. There's some ways to do this, but the easiest way to do this is to get closer to the Wi-Fi router in which your area is in. So for example, if I'm sitting in class and let's say I'm super far away from the classes with the college's or school's Wi-Fi, well, there's really not much I can do. I can try connecting to a you know more local high-speed internet connection, but a majority of time, there's not much you can do there. Physically, you're going to have to get closer to that Wi-Fi router, and that is basically the easiest way to increase your Wi-Fi speed. Now, the other thing you can try doing that I've actually seen a lot of people have success with is actually seeing if you have a massive thick case on your iPhone. If you have a really thick case on your iPhone with like cars in the back and like so many other things, well, the best thing you can try doing is actually removing that case from your phone. So go and just take off that case as you normally would. And then you might want to be able to see that your phone will actually go ahead and basically be able to connect to the Wi-Fi a little bit better. Again, it's going to be such a stretch, but I've seen a lot of people mention this and for somehow, like it kind of does work for some people out there. Now, another thing you can try doing is within your settings application, you might want to go ahead and just see if you go under your Wi-Fi connection, if you do have the ability of connecting to the 5G version of your Wi-Fi. So you can see right here, I'm connected to the 2.4G version of the Wi-Fi. That 2G version of Wi-Fi is probably going to be slower than the 5G version out there. So what I'd recommend doing is clicking into your Wi-Fi connections right here and seeing if there is a faster Wi-Fi connection that you can't actually enable. And for some people out there, there might be one. So go ahead and do that and that might end up working as well. Now, you can also try doing this. It's probably not going to work, but you can try restarting your phone. So go ahead and restart your phone. Go and hold down the buttons, the volume up and the power button right here. If you have one of these iPhones, swipe to unlock or swipe to turn off. And then from there, turn it back on. See if that ends up kind of fixing some issues here and there. If that still doesn't work, like I said, your best bet is to get physically closer to that Wi-Fi router, and that might end up fixing the problem for you. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.